welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com. We have another build of Windows 10 to look at. This is 14385, released on Saturday evening. Uh, first time Microsoft released a build on a, over the weekend like that, and as they want to get things tested, ready for the August 2nd release of the anniversary update of Windows 10. So, what's new in here? Well, they're all fixes, there's no nothing new what it does do is get rid of the pop-up notifications saying that your um, evaluation version of windows 10 uh, expires on the 15th of july that's gone they said there's improved battery life for the surface i've not really seen this yet i've just got this build installed today so maybe when i do the next video we'll be able to see about that uh, there's uh, fixes for spotify crashing uh, fixing issues with google chrome Fix the issue with mobile hotspot that could work in result in the device uh, blue screening when you're using it on the five gig broad um, uh, five gig brand Wi-Fi. They fixed an issue with pin prompts on VPN, and they fixed an issue with LastPass and ad block extensions for Microsoft Edge, not showing in the context menus or showing the right details. Projecting to a PC auto discovery switched off, um, so to have your PC. Uh, beacon so it can be discovered you can project through connect and continuum you have to go through settings and system and uh, enable the windows pc and phones can project to this so um, that's the connect app which um, you can use to beam your content from another phone or from a phone to this or another pc so that's the 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 changes on there the known issues uh, there's a still an issue with hyper-v and um, also when you install PC on a non-US English version you may get a error when you're enabling uh, developer mode and Microsoft do have a fix of that included in their blog post which will include a link to. So that's it really, there's not a huge amount of changes, not a lot to see, I can't really show you any new features because we're getting to the e end of this development process, there's no watermark on there which shows that we're really ready for um, the release preview. So we're probably or ready for release, I should say. So we'll probably get a couple more builds before uh, the final build that's signed off, and then th that'll roll out to everybody on the 2nd of August, and the insiders will get that uh, build a bit quicker, uh, depending on when Microsoft sign it off. So you can go back on our YouTube channel and see videos right back from the first Windows 10 previews and all through the Redstone releases. So uh, you can see them on our YouTube channel, on the digitallifestyle.com, and you can follow me at iSticks on Twitter.